Hello, Magic Maker, and welcome back from the weekend. And boy, what a weekend it has been, right? We got a lot of astrological influences going on. My prediction today for Pisces, sunny and cool, actually, as the moon now moves into your sign and conjuncts Jupiter. We'll talk about that in a minute. For the next couple of days, the moon and your charisma are going to work hand in hand. So this is a great time to be out in the public. This is a great time doing soul service. And what do you do? You always kind of connect people to their higher selves. You are kind of the bridge between God, universe, and the earth. And this is a time where you're probably in a great position to sell yourself. Sometimes people get a little randy during this transit as well. But there's a little irritability in the air. Zip it around in the sun. We're in the final degree today, 29 degrees Capricorn. Now we wake up at 28 degrees. It shifts to 29 degrees sometime around 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So today's going to be a real shift of vibration. As we move into that final degree, that is the most uh, less patient degree that there is the zodiac and I think you are over all this learning when it comes to your place in society. It's been an intense one when you had five planets in Capricorn last Friday during the solar eclipse. So I'm predicting a lot of dramatic shifting going on in your reality in the way you see yourself in the context of the world and we'll begin the next transit here in just a couple of days. Now on Sunday Mercury went direct. Thank goddess. This was a tough one. I always say that every Mercury retrograde it seems that Mercury retrograde always goes during a time when someone the other planets are also really hitting hard. Well, the good news is in a couple of days or so, you're going to find you're more articulate, your phone starts working, things stop, uh, things don't no longer continue to not work. <laughs> I'm recording this still during the retrograde, just so you know. Then my last piece of good news, Pisces and Jupiter. Jupiter has now moved to zero degrees Pisces today. Now, Jupiter typically takes a full year to get through a sign. It took a full year in Aquarius and it was helping you focus on really faith in yourself. Now you'll begin to see that faith kind of pour in and for the next six months, that's it, Jupiter will blaze through Pisces. That means there's going to be absolute rapid expansion of your charisma, your ego, your need to defend yourself, etc. In the beginning parts of this transit, you may find that you're just fed up with certain ways of responding. Maybe you're just fed up with people not respecting you. Maybe you're fed up with not having courage to walk up to the person you're attracted to or fed up with not having courage to tell your boss you're not happy. You're going to be fed up with your current ego. That's Jupiter putting pressure for you to expand and to put yourself out there. But once you do expand, the fortune does come pouring in. So we'll be keeping you abreast of all that. Then also, it is Monday. We're going to do an episode of Meditation Vibration Live with Julie Zipper today. This is her final installment of the Capricorn topic, and she'll be answering questions on camera about Dominion, about Capricorn, and anything else you've posted in the last 30 days. All right, my Pisces, that's all I have to start the week. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So